Hello there, welcome to your latest Met Office forecast. It's been a cold day across many parts and it will remain cold across the UK over the next 24, 48 hours or so at least as Arctic air continues to dominate across the UK's weather pattern. But eventually something a little less cold trying to move in through Tuesday and into Wednesday from the west as Atlantic systems try to start to move in. But for the evening and overnight into Monday morning, it's a cold one. Temperatures below freezing widely across the UK. Areas of sleet and snow pushing south across England and Wales will lead to some icy stretches further. Sleet and snow showers for parts of Northern Ireland and heavy snow showers across Northern Scotland continuing through into Monday morning. An amber snow warning out for Northern parts of Scotland. Another 20 to 30 centimetres could fall here on what has already fallen. We've seen reports reports up to 50 centimetres in places. So deep snow across this part of the world and temperatures widely below freezing, minus two to minus five, and in the countryside, possibly down to minus 10 Celsius for one or two of us. So it could be a tricky commute in places on Monday morning. Areas of sleet and snow, particularly across parts of Northern Ireland, Wales, down into the West Country, as well as down eastern parts of England, further snow showers across northern Scotland too. Icy stretches for all and through the day we continue to see a mixture of sunny spells and wintry showers for all of us and a cold feeling day as well. Winds still coming in from the north so really struggling. Most of us only one or two degrees above freezing, perhaps around four or five degrees across the far southwest. And in fact, many of us may not rise much above freezing at all and stay sub-zero. Add on that northerly breeze and it will feel below freezing for everyone's extra layers will be needed. Meds office warnings do remain in force. So if you are traveling through Monday and into Tuesday, do check before traveling as there could be some tricky traveling conditions out there. And then as we go through Monday evening, overnight into Tuesday morning, we'll see another weather system trying to move in from the Atlantic, bringing an increasing risk of some rain, sleet and snow to parts of Northern Ireland and Scotland. So creating more icy conditions here elsewhere, some wintry showers down western parts of England and Wales, the clearest skies further east, but even in the east we could see one or two sleet and snow showers. And once more temperatures widely falling below freezing down to, again, minus 10 through the countryside of parts of England. So a very cold start here on Tuesday morning, but plenty of sunshine, cloudier skies further north and west, outbreaks of rain, sleet and snow continuing through the day across parts of Northern Ireland and Scotland. Again, snow accumulations building up over the higher ground, some wetter and windier weather trying to move into some western fringes of England and Wales too, which will fall as snow over the higher ground. Something a little less cold trying to creep in, temperatures up to around seven or eight degrees across the far southwest, but for many another cold day, particularly for central and eastern areas struggling to rise around three or four degrees at the very best. And Wednesday, brighter weather around for some of us. At first, a cold frosty start, but then some wetter and windier weather starting to move into western areas as we move through the day. So snow and ice continue to be the main weather hazards with various warnings in force across the country right through the next few days. So do stay tuned to the forecast. See you again soon.